What's good, YouTube? Bro, did y'all even know you can go up here in your mic or I didn't even know you can go up these stairs, bro. I had no idea. But anyways, today is a highly requested video. Y'all have been asking me for my SIGs, my drill moves. So today, I'm going to do a drill moves SIGs video just for you guys. Just make sure you're subscribed if you're new to the channel. And turn that noti bell so you don't miss a stream or a video. If you're one of the first people to comment noti gain. I will be giving you a shout out just like these beautiful people right here. And without further ado, let's get straight into this video. Let's go. All right, so I'm going to show you guys these drill moves in action. I'm going to show some gameplay after we talk about the SIGs. So first off, we're going to go over the SIGs and then I'm going to show you some gameplay. Starting off with drill move number one, we got the most important, which is dribble style. Now, I tried a few dribble styles like Zach Levine, John Moran, DeJounte Murray. But Darius Garland, this this dribble style right here will, will have you moving like a guard. It's the fastest, best to use. Definitely put on this dribble style right here. These other ones are decent, but they don't compare to Darius Garland. Darius Garland got me moving like a small guard. Like I should be moving like a small guard, you feel me? These other dribble styles, like, I don't know, maybe they're good for taller guards, but small guards are just not it. Next up, we got signature size up. A really good signature size up is Trey Young or Rafer Iston. I, I probably butchered that name, but these are the two best signature size up. It's really preference, it's up to you. Right now I'm using Trey Young, but Rafer is a really good signature size up. So but right now I'm using Trey Young, so I will go with Trey Young. Next up, we got regular breakdown combo. Now I don't really use regular breakdown combos. I'm gonna be completely honest, but right now I'm using Steph Curry. When I do use regular breakdown combo, Steph Curry is pretty solid, so I will go with Steph Curry on this one. Next up, we got aggressive breakdown combo. Now, De'Aaron Fox has the best drill moves in the game, so if you ever see De'Aaron Fox, definitely pick him because he for sure has the best drill moves in the game. And for aggressive breakdown combo, De'Aaron Fox's breakdown combo is actually really cheesy. I ain't gonna lie. Like, he has this one move where you can rim run off of it every single time. I'm not I'm not gonna cap, bro. Darren Fox aggressive breakdown combo is really tough. Uh, James Harden is okay. John Morant is okay. I kind of tried them out. I used John Morant last year, but this year is just not as good as it was last year. So, you know, I'm going with Darren Fox. Four escape moves. There's a lot of good ones like Darius Garland, Darren Fox, Stephen Curry. Now, I know what I just said. I just said if you see Darren Fox, go with them. But for this dribble move, I'm going for Steph Curry. Steph Curry escape moves are so good. They're so solid, bro. Like, I don't know what it is about Steph Curry escape moves, but I just prefer it more than De'Aaron Fox. De'Aaron Fox is really good, but for me, I like Steph Curry better. It's just better for me to combo with. I like his moves. And De'Aaron Fox, I think it's a little faster. So I would, if I were you, I would use both of these and then whatever one you like better, go with that one. But for me, I'm using Steph Curry. Next up for combo moves, I'm using Steph Curry. Yo, I might be flight reacts, bro. I'm just glazing Steph Curry. I don't know what it is. I think this is the last Steph Curry dribble move I use, but I really do like his combo moves and I think you would like him too. Another good combo moves is like Zach Levine and like James Harden, but they're all right. They're, they're decent, but they're nothing crazy. I haven't found a better one and better than Steph Curry. So if you can get a Steph Curry, definitely put on Steph Curry combo moves. For crossover, I'm using the Mellow Ball. Now the Mellow Ball has this very glitchy crossover that you can speed boost out of. I actually haven't even figured out how to do it yet. But if you look at my player right now, there's this one like crossover where he swings his body. It's like a crazy speed boost. I don't even know how to do it yet. I literally just found out about it and I put on LaMelo Ball. So I'm gonna figure out how to do that in the near future, I ain't gonna lie. I'll probably figure out how to do it after this video, but I do have the LaMelo Ball crossover. Before the LaMelo Ball crossover, I was using Trey Young. So if you don't wanna use LaMelo Ball, I will go with Trey Young. I was just using Trey Young, but now I got LaMelo Ball. Next up, we got behind the back and I'm telling you right now, Darius Garland, this is like the Jamal Murray behind the back from last year. Like if you just look at it, it's literally like the same animation. You see the stand-up behind the back? Yeah, Darius Garland is basically Jamal Murray. It's not as OP, 
because of how dribbling works in this game dribbling is already kind of clunky you know it's a little it's a little sluggish so you can't just spam the jamal murray but darius garland like it has a good moving behind the back it has a good standing behind the back definitely put on darius garland behind the back it's one of the best if not the best behind the backs next up we got spins now all spins do for me is get me plucked whenever i do a spin i just get plucked i'm not gonna lie i usually spin right into the defender because i never use spins so when i do use spins i mean bro they just never work out but i, I put on pro i didn't want to do too much i don't want my spin to be too flashy so i just put on pro next up for hesitation i got darius garland you guys are seeing a common theme here i like darius garland's signature moves they're actually really solid they're very fast and uh, his moves his and De'Aaron Fox's moves are very good for small guards. So for my hesitation, I use Darius Garland. Before I use Darius Garland, I, I use Pro because Pro is just it's fast. It's not doing too much. It's not like doing anything extra. But right now I'm using Darius Garland. I just think it's better and it creates more space. You know what I'm saying? It creates more space. It's just a better overall hesitation. So I would definitely put on Darius Garland. Now the step back is basically your snatch back. So when you're dribbling, like if you're going to rim run and you do a snatch back, that's your step back. So your step back is very important. And the best step back in the game by far is Zach Levine. You see that little hop back? You're gonna see every player start to do that. You're gonna see almost every player start to use this move. Zach Levine step back is one of the best moves in the game. The separation you gain from that step back is crazy. That little hop back, you're gonna see everybody doing that, bro. Just, just let me, I'm letting you know right now the Zach Levine step back is broken. It's not even a debate. Definitely put on the Zach Levine step back. Also, go-to shots can be used for dribbling. So if you don't have a good go-to shot, I'm going to hook you guys up right now. Put on that John Morant go-to shot. That little cross, you can combo with it so well. Like You see that little cross, a little fast cross Wait, right here? Look, look. Ooh, nah, you could really like... You can really like break someone with that, bro. You can really, if you do that move and then do a snatch back, bro, you're gonna send the, de the defender flying, bro. So for go-to shots, definitely put on John Morant. Now you have my six, it's time to show you some gameplay. I'm not gonna be talking during the gameplay. It's just gonna be background music. I'm gonna break it up into like a little mixtape, just like I did for my build video. If you wanna see my build video, go peep it. So this is the last time you're gonna hear my voice for this video. Hey man, I just wish you guys have a very good day, man. Hope you guys have a blessed day. You know I'm saying? Hopefully you guys, everything works out for y'all today, man. Uh, speaking positive energy into the air. But anyways, man. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Sit back, enjoy the gameplay, and peace.